We never experience freedom through covetousness. Uh, the reality is, is there's only bondage. There's only bondage because you always want what you can't have. And if you never get it, you'll always want it. There's always a sense of bondage. There's no freedom in that. A covetous person will never be satisfied by possessions, even if they do get it. Because they'll always want something more, because that's their character, covetousness. Now Luke 12 gives a, a, a strong warning. Here's what he says. And he said unto them, take heed and beware of covetousness. I mean, here's a, here's a warning. Beware of this thing. For a man's life consisteth not in the abundance of things which he possesses. Here is a warning. Why do you think there's a warning? Because there's danger. Because money is in control of him who's not in control of his money. Listen to this. Behold, the fowls of the air. For they sow not, neither do they reap, nor gather into barns. Yet your heavenly Father feedeth them. Are you not much better than they? So they don't plant, they don't harvest, and then they don't store up things that they've harvested. But God takes care of them. And then he says, Are ye not much better than they? Are, are you not better than the fowls and the birds of the air? God takes care of the birds and they don't do anything. <laughs> They're just lazy. And God takes care of them. Aren't you better than they? So you don't think God will take care of you?